Hello people, today I'll be showing you how to mirror um, components or parts of your drawings um, in Revit. I'll be using Revit 2019 student version um, in architectural template. Um, I have my second floor completed. If you can see that, um, let me use this one here. You can see that the things that I have on this half of um, the floor plans is identical on this half of it. Uh, we can see that there are just a few changes that I have in here. Um, you can see the stairs are the same places, the bedrooms are the same places, the components in the bedrooms and the bathrooms are the same. You have this bath here, you can see this, this like that. Everything is on the opposite side, just exactly the same way. Even the bathtub, um, but you, the only difference is in the bathroom here and then here. This one has a balcony. That is why in a 3D view, you can see that um, this half of the building has a balcony and this side has a glass window, um, which is shown here. So some residents will have a balcony and some residents will have um, the glass window uh, at the corner of the wall. Um, this resident, because they have a balcony, their, ba their bathroom does not go all the way to the wall, and um, that is why they need they have um, a pocket door on both sides, giving access from the bedroom to the balcony, and then from the walk-in closet here to the balcony. Um, this one has no pocket doors going outside, but they have just access to the bathroom and then to the um, the uh, walk walk-in walk closet. The difference between this kind of um, floor plans and this is that this one has a balcony, but a, but a smaller bathroom and a and a smaller walk-in closet. While this one has no balcony, but more room for the bedroom, bathroom, and walk-in closet. So that is the difference in, in here. Show you how to reflect everything on this side. Will be I have deleted my my um, plans, the drawings on this side. So I'll be reflecting this here and this here, here and here, and then reflect this here. Um, the the tool that we'll be using will be in under modify and modify again. We'll be using mirror pick axis. Um, the shot command for it or the keyboard command for it is mm as you can see so to get started i'll first come here um select my component so i choose to select it going to the right direction because that way whatever the um the select box hovers over selects that um completely whatever it hovers over completely so that's something you should know with Revit. If you select towards the left, the first that's touched it, it selects it. It doesn't. It selects. It doesn't need to select it all. But if you are taking it to the right, you can see that until the whole thing, like the dining table here, until the whole thing is in the box, it's not selected. There you go. Not yes. Not yes. But if I was going to the back, just touch it and select it. Touch select it. So there you have it. I will be doing it to the right side so that I can see that everything is well selected. Zoom in to check everything. Yes, everything is selected as I want it to be. And I'll come up here, click on this button, come here, wait, hover over this center wall for the center line to show. Click and wait for a sec. And then there you have it. You can ignore this. It's not going to bother my drawings. And there you have it. I have all the plants reflected on the side exactly how I want it. And I can come here and do the same with this. Select. I've got everything selected my windows, my doors, my pocket door. Yes, that is selected. And mirror. There you have it. And then click 
So now this time I want to move the same thing on this end so I don't have to select it again because you already selected. Just click on this, but it will create. Um, you can see already that there's a problem here. And the problem we have here is that a window, this window that was initially here has been reflected on this side. And we don't have, want to have a window connecting um, both, both apartments because we don't want residents seeing a residents uh, living space. So that will be deleted very soon. That is why this came off. Highlighted walls overlap and blah, 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 blah. Uh, I'll fix that in a sec. And boom. There you have it. I'll do that actually. Like this. And Okay, so sorry about that. I was just figuring out which window I was missing. And there, there it was. All right, so that is fixed. There you have it. And that is gone. Yep. And now it looks good. Um, do the same thing for this side. This window was not selected. Select that. And zoom in to check if that was selected. Yes, it was. Mirror. Click in here. Just wait. Give it a sec. And there you have it. All done. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions, you can leave it in the comment section below. And thank you. You might want to put this window here um, by yourself. That it's an easy fix. And I can just go measure it off of the other ones and then put it right in the correct spot. But I'm pretty sure that that is the correct spot. Two and a half, um, two foot one, I mean and a half so from this end to this end make him move that there you go I can align that there you have it Problem solved. All done. Thanks for watching.